Well, the food celebration continues. And we have our executive producer, Lorena. You have all seen her on the show before, but making his first appearance is her husband, Omar. And they have recently moved here from Texas. And so we're gonna get a little south of the border, at least south of our border, <laughs> uh, Indiana border, uh, treat today. Yes, we, we are. What are we making? Okay, so, you know, we had to make, we make a lot of different recipes, but we decided to make, my husband does Omar's pork apple ribs. Mmm, sounds know, great. Sounds good. So it's a rack of pork. You gotta be careful. I almost bought the wrong one. Not beef, but pork ribs. Okay. Because, yeah. Exactly. And is this something that takes a long time? Do you like cook it for hours and hours and hours? So normally, yes. Normally you'll do about two and a half hours if you're slow cooking. Uh, normally I like to do it on the grill, smoker, smoke it out. Um, if this is just a recipe to do it in the oven. Sure. Which takes about the same amount, two hours. So prep it in the morning, pop it in, and by dinner time it's falling off the bone. Absolutely. Well, yeah. let's dig in All and right. teach me. I'm not that great of a cook, so you're gonna have to, ooh, they gave me a knife. <laughs> All right. So we're gonna have you cut up some apples. So you're gonna take three ha! small apples <laughs> and cut them out into slices. Okay. Please be careful, oh my God. Do I have to de-seed them? I just cut them on the side. Just oh, like support. this? Yeah, there you go. Okay. I don't have to peel them, though. No. To peel? Mm -hmm. Okay, I don't like that, because I don't really like to peel apples. Or potatoes. That's Jackie's job. <laughs> All right, and so then here is our beautiful rack right here. <laughs> oh, that looks good. <laughs> and then what do we start with? Uh, you do want to make sure, we've already done it, you want to make sure you take off the membrane on the back of the ribs. But it gets a better cook, and it actually starts soaking up some of those juices that you want in there. So okay. first what we're gonna do is go ahead and let's just get some sea salt. Sea salt. Now is that in comparison to just regular, regular table salt, right? You'd wanna use, this is very Yeah, specific. I mean you can use table salt, I prefer, that's good. Yeah, okay. mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And, then, and then flip it. Yeah, mm -hmm. put some salt on the other side. Oh, look at you. See, normally, um, he's doing all the work and I'm opening up the bottle of wine, but you know. Well, it's too early in the morning for that. <laughs> you better get some grape juice up yeah. in here. <laughs> all right, uh, normally we're, we can also add pepper, but we didn't bring any pepper, so we're gonna go with some um, a seasoning that I like to use. Uh, well, luckily we're at the Martins. <laughs> so I suppose we could just run down and get whatever we need. What's that you're putting on there now? This and is an apple spice, a oh. apple wood spice that we found. Yeah. And so you want to put a ton on there because this is like part of oh, that apple flavor. It smells so good. Mm. Apple wood rub. Okay. Mm. Mm. I'm not going to ruin it by no, doing no, no. it. I'm going to be generous. Be as generous as you want. Now, is this something that you had for family gatherings in Texas? Yes. Or like just on a random Tuesday? Random Tuesday or family <laughs> gathering. Okay. Really. We do a little bit of both. Yeah, right. we do cook a lot. Yeah, uh, at home or whatever. We have a huge family back in Texas, so you know people would come over a lot, get the grill out, Graze. grill. Yeah. Right. That yeah, seems exactly. like a Texas thing. Yep. To do. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Okay. okay. Mm. All right. We're gonna go ahead and put all the apples. Spread them out throughout. You can put some on top. And is this something that I should be aesthetic about, or is it? Doesn't matter? What it does. I mean, it does you know, not have to be aesthetic. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Well, you know. Craig likes everything really pretty. <laughs> the gays have standards. Apparently they don't have gays in Texas. Who knew? Of and course they do. Right. But then we do make a little sauce with it, right babe? Make yeah. a sauce. Okay. Normally it's, um, I already have some pre-made. Um, normally it has some teriyaki sauce, some barbecue sauce, oh, a little bit of apple, apple juice. cider vinegar. Okay. Um, once you mix it all in, you'll, ha you'll also add some brown sugar to it and then you'll coat it over. Normally you'll leave this overnight or a few hours before mm -hmm. you cook it so that it can soak in all these okay. things. Yeah. And then... So you're on your second bottle of wine before this yeah, is even ready. Yeah, about this time, you know. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm happy with that. I I'm, have to tell I you, I smells sides, guys. So I got good. Sides. Yeah, I mean, all the juices kind of help um, with it. And it's, like I said, the sweet and savory mm -hmm. is what we like. So again, this is brown sugar, Teriyaki, barbecue sauce, apple cider vinegar. Oh, and you need to, yeah, because apple sauce. Yeah. yeah. Soaked, girl, soak it. And then we poke holes, correct? Right? Yeah. <laughs> right. So the ribs. Mm -hmm. Put the holes on the side. Which we did already. And then once we do that, we do put it into our pan here. Yeah, we put it in here. Let's, yeah. Uh, oh, that's right. Two cups of apple juice. 
Just so, into the, the bare pan. Yeah. Right into okay. the bare pan. So the apple juice now goes in there. And I'm just gonna guesstimate okay. two cups. Yeah. <laughs> and then you poke holes in this. Yes. And so as this cooks and simmers. Oh yeah, do you want to wash this? Normally you'll do about a cup of apple cider or a half a cup. Or a splash. Yeah. Yeah. And so then as that cooks and and bubbles up. Yes. In the, oh, yeah, and it gets bad. really delicious. Okay, yeah. and then we, well, TV magic, right? TV magic. <laughs> we already have our... So, in real life, how long would you put that in the oven for, Omar? Two and a half hours. Okay. Oh, oh my gosh. It smell, you, I wish you had smell vision. <laughs> but you don't. And so there it is. And then so your apples, your juices, everything. Apple ribs. Omar's, <laughs> Omar's pork Omar. apple ribs. And you saw it right here on Hometown Living.